I'm Jeff Michelle, along with Commissioner John Swafford on this ACC Now, brought to you by Ruby Tuesday. Here at ACC Kickoff, Commissioner, you brought up a number of subjects today in your State of the Conference address. I think one issue that came up, protecting the athletes and taking care of them, especially on the football field. Describe what the conference is trying to do to, to keep an eye on the athletes and protect them. Well, our athletic directors voted uh, in a meeting yesterday here, here in Pinehurst to, uh, and we've been talking about this with our medical people on campuses, uh, to put a medical uh, person in the booth, one for each team. Uh, it would be someone who's on their staff that knows their athletes and uh, preferably the same person uh, every game, home and away, conference, non-conference, uh, as another set of eyes uh, looking at the field from above uh, with the idea of, of seeing if there are medical problems or, or issues with a player that somebody on the sideline may not see. Uh, and and I, we feel like that that's the best approach uh, to take. It leaves it in the institution's hands, which we think is appropriate. Uh, and, and it utilizes personnel that uh, knows the medical history of their players, knows the players themselves, and can assist the individuals that are on the sideline uh, and their medical teammates, so to speak, in terms of uh, helping to identify and get a player off the field that may be having some physical problems that hasn't taken himself off the field. I know another issue that came up, and it goes along the same lines of looking at how an athlete is having the experience of being a student athlete in university is time commitment. Certainly a lot of hours are, are put in. What kind of ways are you looking now at how many hours are putting in and perhaps ways to change that? Well, we're spending a lot of time getting some information back from the athletes themselves because obviously they're the ones that live that life and are affected the most. Uh, but the, the demands of playing and competing at this level uh, are tremendous. And I, I think it's a case of trying to find the right sweet spot, Jeff, where uh, our athletes really have an opportunity to compete at the highest level, but also have an opportunity to, to be students and to, uh, to get a, a quality education, leave with a degree, and also have some, some other experiences uh, of an extracurricular nature, uh, be able to take the courses they need to take when they need to take them. Uh, just the whole student athlete experience in combining their sport with their academic experience and other extracurricular activities. It's a lot and uh, you know we're looking at off season, we're looking at in season, we're looking at summer. Uh, all of that has to come into play uh, but you really can't get to a point of, of making good decisions about that and good rules about it without involving the input of the athletes themselves. You were an ACC student athlete once upon a time. What did it mean to you to be able to balance all those things and how it's prepared you for the rest of your life? Well, it was a challenge then, but you, you learn so much from it. And, and our institutions have so much to offer uh, beyond athletics. Athletics teaches you a tremendous amount of things that you carry the rest of your life. And I think we all know what those are. But at the same time, if you can have that experience on the athletics and competitive side, and also have the opportunity uh, as fully as you possibly can to experience the academic opportunities that are, that, that are on our campuses uh, in full measure and, and some of the extracurricular activities. Uh, that's when it's just an extraordinary experience. Commissioner, I really appreciate it. Jeff, good to be with you. Uh, that's the ACC Now on the ACC Digital Network, brought to you by Ruby Tuesday.